Hey guys, I'm back. Today we're going to talk about Jason Fung and intermittent fasting. Now, out of all the gurus and experts on fasting, uh, he is number one. Uh, most of you know about him. Some of you don't. And if you don't, I highly recommend getting his book because his information is spot on. He's a Canadian nephrologist, which is a doctor that specializes in kidney disease. Uh, he's an expert in fasting. He has three best-selling books. One is The Obesity Code. That's, a, that's the one I would recommend starting with. He's also co-founder of the Intensive Dietary Management Program. The other founder is Megan Ramos, who works with him. And Megan came to my last um, keto summit, and she flew down, did an amazing presentation on intermittent fasting, and she gave some incredible stories and some of the things that they're doing in their clinic. Postmenopausal women who are doing fasting are getting amazing anti-aging benefits. And another practitioner that works with Dr. Fung is Nadia Potaguana. And she also came to the summit and spoke on polycystic ovarian syndrome and some of the great success that they're getting doing fasting with that condition. Now, there's a lot of data that he talks about, but what most people like about him is that he's very, very simple in his explanations. And one of the key things that he talks about is the calorie in, calorie out theory or dogma is completely and utterly false. It's not a scientific law at all. And it definitely does not work with his kidney patients uh, who have diabetes. I mean, the mainstream concept of eating less and moving more has been proven not to be the thing that really, really works. So the more people that are studying to cut their calories, especially fat calories, are basically setting themselves up for failure. Not only do they get even more cravings and more hungry, they um, just can't lose the weight, no matter how hard they tried. He also presents a lot of hardcore, um, credible studies on supporting fasting and lowering insulin and doing a low carb diet. Because when you lower carbs, you lower insulin. The hormone insulin controls whether you gain weight or you lose weight. So when you reduce insulin, you lose weight. When you increase insulin, you gain weight. Now, this is one reason why a diabetic type 1 that doesn't have any more insulin will tend to be thinner than a case with diabetes type 2 where they have higher amounts of insulin. They're actually many times just overweight. And the more insulin that you have that's stimulated, the more that it creates insulin resistance. The key thing behind prediabetes and diabetes and metabolic syndrome and a lot of other health problems so it's similar to uh, like antibiotic resistance. If you're exposed to antibiotics, your body develops resistance against that. Well, the same thing with insulin. So the simplicity is, is just to decrease insulin to fix this problem right here. And the two ways you do it is you reduce your carbs and you stop consuming food so frequently. You do intermittent fasting. Fasting allows the body to clear out the excess fat so it's cleaning internally. It's also cleaning the fat around the organs and inside the organs, uh, especially liver fat. And uh, Dr. Jason Fung does not recommend keto without fasting. And that's something that I emphasize as well. Because if you're doing fasting and you're lowering insulin, why would you want to eat something that raises insulin? That kind of counters the effect. So the combination of these together are very, very powerful. So in summary, if you're the person who wants to do keto, and intermittent fasting, and you're on some medication or you're on some program with a physician, Dr. Fung would be a great doctor to work with to get that additional extra help um, to deal with the medication aspect. And for those of you that are not familiar with Jason Fung, um, I would recommend the Obesity Code. You can go to Amazon, get the hardback or the Kindle version. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video. So if you want more knowledge on how to create a healthy body, Subscribe now and get daily notifications.